Hello, and welcome to Pickled Alice Art. My name is Alice, I like pickles, and this is some of my art. Those are my favorite Inktobers of this year. So, here's the backstory of today's speed paint. My agency, Astound, asked me and a bunch of other artists to do something special for their Halloween kind of blog posts and social media platforms. The theme for the blog posts was haunted locations. So I doodled some ugly sketches and this is what I came up with. My first idea was a girl and some ghosts both being scared of each other. I thought this was a pretty cute idea. And then my second idea is a spooky shed in the forest and two children and a dog in the foreground being greeted by a ghost in a kind of creepy way. And then my third idea was kind of abstract. A whale going through the ground and out a cave with a kid witnessing it in the foreground. And then the last idea was a big creepy cave with one ghost awaiting the viewer. I sent these to my agent and she picked these two of the four. I ended up choosing number two because I wanted the main character to be big enough to be seen so you could see what the expression was on her face, and I also thought that the idea was very cute and a little bit different. I still want to do this one though. I think it's weird and awesome. I just, it just wouldn't wor have worked for this project because it needs to be a broader appeal. You know, it needs to meet a lot of different demands in the children's illustration area as opposed to one kind of person. Anywho, let's go to the video.
I made a new kind of ghost music in Apple GarageBand. Um, I hope you like it. I tried to make it sound kind of ghosty and kind of... Anywho, I think this came out super duper cute. I really like this girl's white hair. Like, was she scared of ghosts before and then it turned white? Is she a ghost hunter? Ghost therapist? Why are the ghosts scared of her? Why is there a bird ghost? The point of any illustration is to tell a story, and I think this tells a story. I want to know what happens next. What happens after? Does she talk to the ghost? Do the ghosts run away? Does she have to do a camp out? You want to ask questions in your art. Illustrations tell story, and fine art is just there. It's just doing its thing, being fine. Let's float these ghosts down the runway. Whoosh. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next week. Woo!